You see anybody out there? Yeah. Hi guys, welcome to the stream. And if you're new, my name is Boomer and I play games. And if you're not new, welcome back guys. It's good to see you. Uh, today is Star Wars. Oh Lord, Eric, finally. You know what? I, I, I regret even mentioning to Seagam that you needed to be on stream. I regret that completely now. You had to come in here with with that. <laughs> okay, bye. You know what's funny is when I left my day job today, I went and told like all the coworkers that I actually like. I was like, okay, okay, bye. I always lean up to them and say that. Okay, bye. And and what's funny is like um, I'm normally out of there by like eleven thirty, and um, and everyone that kept walking by today was like, you're not left. You're not you're not gone yet. You haven't left yet. And I was like, oh no, I left an hour ago. This is a hologram. And everybody cracked up. I said day job, not gay job. If it was a gay job, I'd probably still be there because I'm the gayest. No, um, it's good to see you, even though you're being mean to me. <laughs> um, I hope everybody's having a good day. I'm not. I'm trying to, but I'm not really. And I have a mouthful of peanuts still. I, I, I've been... Snacking, I just, just literally, and I didn't even eat that much of the peanuts. Joseph actually ate like a capful. So, like, I've only had like a handful or two, but I've been eating peanuts. So, I've got like. Eric, you just can't help yourself, can you? You just can't help yourself. So, anyway. Today we're doing our last Blackberry Lemonade, and then I guess on our, our stream tomorrow, we'll be doing either regular lemonade or pink lemonade, or I think maybe raspberry. Raspberries! And I know, Eric, you'll get that reference. Ha ha ha! I knew you would! I knew you would! I knew you would! <sighs> we're going to start just saying random things like Carol Channing and be like, I've got a lovely bunch of coconuts. <laughs> And raspberries. All I can say is, listen, all I can say is, um, the, the, the Pandora box version of Carol Channing, <coughs> excuse me, is amazing. <coughs> and the, uh, Bob the Drag Queen version of Carol Channing is, is pretty good too. But I felt like, yeah. I felt like Pandora did a much, much better job. Not because she was white, no. But um, I felt like Bob the Drag Queen's uh, presentation of her kind of like basically made her, and I don't mean it to sound like the way it's going to sound. I, I have no other way of saying it other than like, basically she just played like any female black character and kind of gave her like a bit of a Carol affectation. And for those of you who don't know what Eric and I are talking about, we're talking about um, Snatch Game of, um, what's up, Melissa? I was talking about you today. I'm so glad you hopped in. Um, but yeah, we were, we were talking about Snatch Game on RuPaul's Drag Race. Robbie, what is up? Everybody's getting in today. I'm so excited. I'm so stoked. I'm so stoked. See, this is this is it. This is what I love about this. Like, I'll be having a bad day, and then I get on here, and all my friends hop on here, and I'm just like, oh my god, I've got Eric, I've got Melissa, I've got Robbie. Now, Seagam needs to bring his butt in here. I know, I haven't started. I haven't started. Oh, no, 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 no. Wait, 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 Robbie. You should have been here. Last week, oh my gosh, last week, I ran around for 30 minutes in-game. I shopped in the item shop. I did a tour of my entire settlement build in Fallout 76, and then I ran around and did questing. Yeah, I did questing for 30 minutes before Seagam told me. And I was like, and I was like, and you, you... You ought to watch the video. I think, I, I don't know if I've uploaded it to YouTube, but it, it's still in here on Twitch. My ear just started ringing because I've been clapping my hands so much. But I'm telling you, like, I was just running around doing my game, just having a grand old time, filling a, doing a quest and, like, inoculating myself against the Scorch Plague. And I just happened to glance over. And there's there's C Game. He's like, you know, we can't see anything but, like, this much of your, your stream right. And I was like, oh. 
I was like, oh my gosh, is Robbie in here? Because this always happens when Robbie's in here. This always happens. I was just like, I know, I know Robbie is watching the stream. Okay, so let me shrink this down. And let me move this over here. And then blow it back up so it fills the screen. And then I'll do that so I can actually see what I'm doing. And we'll get back into the game. Now it's going to have to load because I was tabbed out. It takes all of a second. Okay, so now... I just logged in and I went ahead and claimed my daily off off stream and then I launched. The last time we played, we picked up a couple of um we picked up just a couple of quests. Just a couple, just a teensy, just a smidge. Alright, so we've got to go. Let me wait, what is this? This is all garbage, right? Yes, that's not garbage, but I can't use it. Same. Okay. We're on the way. We're on the way. It's fine, Robbie, if you weren't there. I mean, I fail so often. You're not going to miss much, I promise. Okay, just making sure we're going the right way. Eric, are you playing uh, Minecraft today, or are you just chilling, or did you just wake up? Oh my god, it's gotten so dark outside. Do you guys think I should open up my other set of curtains? I won't open the blinds, because that'll really wash me out, but I'll definitely open up the curtains. Okay, and, and pay no attention to the heating pad. If you were, if you had watched, um, if you had watched yesterday's stream, you would see the I'm not going to do it again, but yesterday I actually turned around. I didn't pull up my shirt, but I showed how swole that spot is in my back. It's, I had a really hard time at work today. I'm not trying to whine or anything, but it, it's starting to get to the point where I'm having a hard time, like, getting up and down and, and just walking. <laughs> there are times when I've tried to, like, stand up and my back's caught and I've had to, like, just wait it out until it decides to unhook itself, basically. It's... I'm having a hard time. Um, it's it's just an old injury, Melissa. It, it just it's started flaring up a lot more lately. Okay, yeah, we're going the right way. I'm just making sure. Um, I I hurt myself at work through my own stupidity. Yeah, and I'm getting older too. I, um, Eric is absolutely right. I decided I was I was in a hurry one day a couple of years ago, and I picked up a big giant container of metal hooks. It, um, weighs about two hundred pounds. And I've been paying for it ever since. Okay, so we've got to go here. This is where we have to go. Have a safe and pleasant stay. I like how nice that those robots are. Have a safe and pleasant stay, he said. This is giving me severe fifth element vibes. Like, every time I get on one of these things, I'm like... I keep waiting for Lilu to just crash into the back of the cab, although there isn't a back of the cab. So I guess you'd have to hop into, like, the little passenger seat, I'm assuming. Eric, be nice. You're so mean to me. For me to be so nice to you, you are so mean to me. Yeah, it really does. Does that mean I'm clubbing Dallas? Okay. Apparently, one of the personal conquest things was to just hail a taxi. Taxi! Okay, um... Okay, so we got a quest over here. Oh, it's a heroic. Should we do it? The last... You know what? Um... Um, did you get a concussion at our work, or was this an, an old job? I don't have my cup today, guys. I didn't feel like going downstairs and getting it. So, we're just drinking out of a bottle. I'm, I'm thinking about picking up a heroic, because the last time we were very close to this area, we did a heroic. We soloed it. It was hard, but it was fun. It's a pleasure, Master Jedi. I'm Officer Stanson for Public Security. Trying to keep peace and order down here. We we're fighting a war against the Black Sun. We wish I could say we were winning. Word has it they're running an illegal surgery clinic. 
giving wanted criminals new faces. Oh! Rest. Republic security should end their operation. We've tried, but the facility moved shop the second they see our uniforms. Oh, okay. And maybe you could pay this clinic a visit, smash their illegal surgery droids, pull their patient files, show them the Republic's still in charge. Um, we'll go with Gladly. Black Sun's clinic won't operate another day. Good to hear. The sooner we shut them down, the quicker we can clean up courses. Destroy the Black Sun surgery droids, then download their patient files. That's all we need to pull them out. A pallet fell on your twice. head? When was this? Why did I not hear about this? Well, hey, Kayla Bell. It's good to see you, sweetie. For those of you who don't know, Kayla Bell, and here's my niece. Oh, I need to sell some of this stuff here real quick. Only the best sold here. Feel free to browse. Sorry, I just noticed that. Um, uh, I gotta, I gotta fix my automod. It's, it's picking, it's flagging like all kinds of words. Okay, so where do I have to go? Hmm, wait, this one here is the cabin bills, and this one here is the heroic. Let's do the heroic first. Let's do that first. Uh -huh, uh -huh. No, auto mod. Thank you very much. You're the Decepticon. You tricked me into thinking we were friends. Now you guys are dead. Okay, so which way do I have to go? I had to go through here. Okay. We're going to make some stuff happen today, guys. We're going to do a heroic. I'm kind of scared, actually. <laughs> All right, let's, uh, let's go ahead and use a stem real quick. Is that a versatility? No, command stem. Mm, presence or mastery. Let's do mastery. Well, someone's been killing over here. Oh, it's not. It, I don't. It's not like a um, instance situation. All right, let's do it. Yeah, these guys are a little bit tougher than regular. Oh, I don't need your help, dude. I don't need your help. No, no, no. Go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. I don't like it. That is 100% unnecessary. Y'all can go away. Y'all can go away. I don't mean to be rude or hateful, but I don't like when people try to help me. I don't like that. That's why I prefer an instance location. Damn it. <laughs> Oh, I hate when people help. I hate when people help. It drives me nuts. I know that sounds mean and rude, but I can't stand when people help. I hate it. I absolutely hate it. This dude. I'm going after the droids, because I'm salvaging them. I mean... I know, it is almost like I'm playing online. Hush. I know that's, I know that's stupid, but I can't stand... I can't stand that. I know that sounds so stupid. God, that's loud. I really... I hate playing with other people. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. <laughs> Seagate 
Damn, what is up, dude? I'm so glad I've got everybody in here today. I feel like a rock star. Good lord, this thing just does not quit, does it? All right, let's uh, loot him. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, they went through there, which I can't go in. So where am I supposed to go? Wait, wait, wait. Oh, no, 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 wait. There's a, there's a quest objective here. Oh, oh, here we go. Oh, we haven't even started a heroic yet? Yes, we have. We've started it. We just... Okay, here we go. Okay, because I'm not in a party, I get to do it by myself. I'm happy about that. You guys know I don't like... I don't play well with others. I never have. I never will. I'm not here for group content. I'm not here for a good time. I'm here for a long time. <clears throat> Excuse me. So sorry. So sorry. Okay. Oh, here they are. There's the surgeon droids. Yes, queen. Gotcha. Oh, there's one more. Oh, there's one more. Oh, you again suck it. I wonder what kind of loot I'm getting. Hello. Scavenging. All right, let's scavenge the other ones. We're getting a little bit of stuff. Silica and Desh, whatever the hell that is. It sucks. Saturday's probably going to be the only days I really see you stream. I know, but I'm so glad that you're here, sweetie. I love when you hop in. I really do. I miss you already, too. I, I told Drew today I miss you already. Like, I've only seen you once in a week, in, in this past week, and it's killing me. I hate this. <laughs> I feel like we broke up. <laughs> I don't know what you're shooting at, but it ain't me. Oh, there's more over there. Okay. Wait, should I go in here? Oh, yeah, I should definitely go in here. Yes! Now you got... Oh, there's a lot of them in here. They're beating up on T7. Oh my goodness. Dude, get over here. Enjoy my lightsaber cuddles. In fact, I had to put some things in my freezer. My aunt and cousin are coming down tomorrow. Tell them I said hey. I miss them. They'll probably be like, um, you're, <laughs> you're so stupid. <laughs> no, I'm front. <laughs> you're so stupid. I can't with you. You're so stupid. <sighs> if you told them that, they'd probably be like, who? Do what? I wonder if I can skip across this part right here. Oh, I can. What? I love this. I love that for me. How did I not see these things? What the hell? Thank you. 
Now you die. Yeah, Eric, you don't have to be mean, you just are mean. I feel like I'm about to have a fight with something in here. Oh, there you guys are. Right on time. I'm getting a little bit of a uh, of uh, salvage here. Oh, I got some boots. I got some boots. Those boots were made for walking. Yes. And the other surgery droid is over here. Oh, 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 I'm going to blow you guys up. Yes! Now you die. These, these big razor droids ain't, they... I wanted to say they're kind of tough, but this one here wasn't shit. All right, I have to download the clinic's client list. And come on, come on, come on. And that's over here, apparently. Wait. Is it? What? Wait, no, it's over here. Oh, it was on the other side. We were there already, doy. Oh, well. This would be so much easier if I had, like, a jetpack. I'm just saying, it's just zoom right across. I hear something. Like, I hear fighting or something, but... I didn't see anything. Here we go. Client list. Here we go. Gotcha. And that was it. This was so easy. I should be doing I should be doing heroics more often. In the Red Lake Crew nursing home. Shady Pines, Ma, Shady Pines. We got a good bit of XP for that too, like over nine thousand. Okay. Now we're out of here, and we got to go pick up our cabin bills. Be nice if I could find like a treasure chest or something every once in a while. That'd be nice. What's up, Kayla Bell? I hope you guys are all having a really good day, by the way. Except Eric, he's me. Poor Eric, we're gonna give him a damn complex. He's gonna, everyone's picking on me. Everybody thinks I'm mean. All right, so let's go look for the cabin bills. Now, are they? I'm assuming they're down here as well, but just this direction. Well, I'm glad you showed up, Eric. I'm glad all of you showed up. I love when everybody's in here. It's so fun. All right, so we're not where we need to be yet. We're getting there. We got to keep going down these ramps. I was about to say stairs, but these are ramps. Oh, 
Come on, come on. There's some kind of junk here. Yeah, it's a dash junk pile. I don't know what dash is. Got me pouring peanuts all over my desk here. Trying to keep up with you guys. I'm not supposed to be snacking right now. <clears throat> Look at that. Yeah, Eric and I have known each other. God. I mean, I've known Eric since I was with my, my late husband. Like, I've probably known Eric close to 20 years. God, dog. Eric, we've known each other that long since I was skinny. All right, so we have to get eight stacks of those cabin bills. And none from them, apparently. Oh. I don't think so. And nothing. Well, ding dang it. I thought there was like four of them. I guess I killed all four of them. Okay, well. I still haven't found any of these bills I'm supposed to be looking for. But there's a something here. Haha. <laughs> It's got to be longer than that, Eric, because I knew you when Chris was alive, and I've been with Joseph for, like, 12 years. We got something purple. Oh, and I see a yellow loot as well. That's that's the um the good stuff. And something purple. What did I get? Underworld Cindy. Oh that's just a um that's just a uh, companion gift. Oh he hit me with something that is unnecessary. I'm not trying to talk to you. I'm trying to loot this guy. And they're fighting with those little vibro swords that we start off with. Die! Ha ha! All this and so far, all we found is one stack of these damn bills. Maybe it just feels like I've known you for that long. Hmm. We got to go back. We done left the area we were supposed to be in. Alright, let's do this. Yep, there's there's another one right there. That man was fully tased, wasn't he? Oh, I got four that time. No, three that time. I'm fine with that though. All right, we're getting there now. We're getting set. We're, we're cooking with fire now. Oh, 
Oh, it's this guy. This guy. Get over here. And then you. Oh, they didn't drop shit. All right, let's attack the droid. I've been friends. That's true. These these young whippersnappers, they just don't know, do they? You know what, you guys? I had I I said I was going to stick to our um our schedule. I'm just all I keep thinking is I would rather be playing Fallout 4 right now. <laughs> All right, we just need two more. <gasps> Excuse me. My goodness, that was rude. <laughs> Peed and marked his territory, ladies and gentlemen. So, Joseph and I are both a little upset because, um, I'm a mod, I think I need to ban someone. <laughs> Finally! You know what? Finally, he decides to dust off his mod hat, guys. Ooh! Finally! After only being a mod for months now, all of a sudden, that's it, I'm calling the cops. Ah! You know what's funny is, you make a joke about that, but anytime we're at the house, and something like, somebody, like Joseph says something silly like that, I'll grab my phone and be like, I'm calling the police. Um, I've killed everything here like twice, or thrice for that matter. He dropped something purple. I'm gonna give him a purple nurple. Oh, we got it, we got it, we got it. We got all of them that time. <laughs> so good, man. I'm trying to figure out, okay, so I still got to keep going straight ahead. I'm fine with that. I'm trying to do it as quickly as I can without pulling any enemies. Oh! Okay, okay, I, I got scared. I was like, oh, I'm about, I'm about to die. Mm. That was too much. Team, too much. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. The Constitution says you do. I don't know if we need to have that conversation, do we? I had to get me a drink of something. All them peanuts. I was making peanut butter in my mouth. Okay. I have to speak to Kira Carson to finish this um, story quest, like the class quest, I think is what it is. Please select an available route. Oh, so they're both in this direction. Alright, not mad about it. Yeah, we're not going to talk poli politics because no one, no one has the right answer when it comes to politics except myself. My channel, my rules. Yes! 
I want some fried chicken. What's bad is we have fried chicken downstairs. Oh, we also have soup that he made. And I'm, I'm like, I want the soup as well. So maybe I'll have like a piece of fried chicken and a bowl of soup to go with it. Chicken and soup. What do you think? Shall we do it? And then after, like, oh, what, the way it's going to work is I'm going to stream. When I get off my stream, I'll have my chicken and my soup. Uh, can you just land, dude? And then um, I'm going to lay down and probably put, like, because I've got, I've got brick crumbs on. Um, he made, like, hamburger soup. Um, I've got, like, brick crumbs on DVD. Hmm. I think we'll get, we'll turn this one in first because it's not the class quest. What do we have in my bags? Okay, I know the shoes are good. Yes. And then I've got an MK2 lockbox. Contains two pieces of armor. Let's see what's in there. Uh, what did it give me? Oh, a nice waist piece. That's not what I'm going to do. I meant to do that. That's how I meant to do it. Okay. I thought it gave me two pieces of armor. Did it not? Where's focus? I guess it gave me a focus. That's a... What is this? Oh, generator. What is that for? And that's focus as well. And then what is this? Oh, blaster rifle. All right. Girl, you could say it because we both know you're not going to do nothing adult for soup. <laughs> leave that one alone for when I talk to you Tuesday. We'll, have, we'll finish this conversation Tuesday. Alright, so where am I going? Oh, I gotta, okay, I gotta go over the river and through the woods here to talk to Senator Narin de Hill. Mm. You two are, you two are really like tripping me out. Oh, this is the pig guy. The guy that literally just grunts and oinks. Ugh. I brought what you asked. Hi, Dreadism. It's nice to see you in chat, man. Hope you're having a great day. Stick around if you want. Watch the show. Hang out with all our friends in here. This guy is so tiny. Did he give did I get a did I get something? Oh, I didn't have to make any like choices. I'm trying to heal up my arm, got inflamed, pinch nerves. Ooh, what did you do? That makes my neck hurt. I'm not joking, like I just had a twinge right here in my neck. Oh. It sucks. I can't Oh, you know what? I feel your pain because um I fell from a two foot stepladder and tried to catch myself and I shattered my wrist and my elbow. So I could not game for like two and a half, three months. Oh, near fatal car crash. Ooh, well, I'm glad you, I'm glad it wasn't fatal. I'm glad that um, it's, it's just a situation where you can't play for a little bit. I'm sorry you have chronic pains though. I'm actually on a heating pad right now. I'm not saying my pain compares to yours because I know that sucks. And not only is it physical pain, but it's mental pain as well because you can't like, Gaming is like an escape sometimes. Like when I have, well, I've had headaches so bad I couldn't play my games. But like if I'm in pain sometimes, I'll I'll play a video game and I'll kind of lose myself in it and I forget about my pain for a while. And I've 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 read stories of of uh, hospitals where they use video games as pain management. And both of these are crappy, crappy, crappy. 
Hmm. I guess I'll just... They're both gonna be crap, so... <laughs> Excuse me. Well, I'm sorry you're having that pain, dude. I really... I hate that for you. And I hope it goes away soon, and I hope you're able to game again soon. Do you play Star Wars The Old Republic? <laughs> no, Eric. I'm not what's giving you pains. It's your old old decrepit age oh wow bless your heart man see Eric you can be nice I'm proud of Eric when he's nice to my chat it's just mean in Seagam that he's mean to Oh, hey, I know what I meant to ask. Michaela, um, are, are, do you have any cookies left? Your Uncle Joey wants to know, because he was like, how many cookies do you think she let her mom and daddy have? And I was like, uh, none. Those are her cookies. That's a PvP mission. I'm not doing those. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. nope. All right, so now we got to go talk to Kira Carson. And it's the only quest we have right now, so this will be linear. Like, like we will not get lost. <laughs> yeah, I had a feeling, sweetie. I really did. I, t I told Joseph I was going to ask, but I was pretty sure you were out. They were good, weren't they? He saved me a couple. I had a couple. Well, they were your cookies, sweetie. That's what they were there for. You know what? I thought about doing an imp. I really did. I thought about playing an imperial character. I see another quest popping up. What is this? Oh, wait, is that... That's a daily heroic box, which we just did a heroic, so... We're not worried. Alright, we're gonna go to level two. Oh, see, I'm not a... I'm not a PvPer. I've never enjoyed PvP in any... In any MMO. To be fair, though... Like, I love talking to people and interacting with people. I love being social, but I don't like playing with other people. I know that sounds so nuts. I know it sounds so nuts. Where the hell is this girl? Oh, yeah? I gave up. I have never ran a guild on, on Star Wars or Republic, but, like, in World of Warcraft, I run a guild. Exactly. That's exactly it. I spend... See, I work with the public. I work in retail. Um, and so I have people in my face constantly, constantly, constantly. So, like, when I get home, my game time is, like, my alone time. Look up Young Fly Duke. Let me write that down, because I am definitely going to look you up. Oh, that was you writing that, Kayla. I'm sorry. I was thinking that was um, Dread writing that. Where's my ink pen? There it is. It was right where I left it. I just... I'm always shocked when things are where I leave them because Joseph is really bad about taking my ink pens and my notepads. Like, he's so bad at that. Retail is a living nightmare. It really is. Um, I've been doing it for... Uh, oh, God, over... God, I've been working in retail basically since I was like... 18, so, good lord, I'm 42 now, yeah, um, I, I actually am lucky in that while I do work retail, I don't, I'm not like a cashier or a stalker or anything like that, I tend to actually work by myself, but I have to deal with clients constantly, 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 don't get me wrong, I love my job, I love what I do, I make decent money doing it, it could always be more, I say that a lot. Um, okay, sweetie, yeah, send me one of his videos, but, um, but yeah, so when I, when I play video games, even if I'm on an MMO, I tend to lone wolf it. I really do. Like I, <laughs> I'll join guilds and I'll be social. Um, but everyone's like, oh, you want to do this, this and this with this? And luckily it's always right as I'm about to log out. Now here's the thing about that. I go into work more than welcome to join, even if you just want to solo play. 
That sounds awesome. I might I might take you up on that. Send me a follow. That way I'll I'll have you in my list and I'll I'll, I'll send you a follow as well. That way if I um if I do I'll be able to message you and be like, hey, this is this is my tune I made for this. Um, and we might, do, after we uh, have been playing this one for a while and get him leveled up a little bit, um, we might do an Imperial playthrough. And that'd be a really good way for, like, um, me to learn the Imperial side as well as, like, hang out with you guys in your guild and whatnot. That sounds awesome. Alright, so we're entering a story area. So this is going to be a little bit of talky-talky. I'm hoping. Oh, yep, yep, yep. <laughs> Oh, Jesus. The bad guys. The bad guys. Sorry. These guys get points for courage, but we're a little outnumbered. There's more than a few trigger happy thugs in that docking bay. <laughs> Indicate more than a few enemies. The are threatened to kill Dr. Tarnas, but they might be bluffing. I'm not even sure they have him. We can't take that chance. Bluff or not, the doctor is in danger. So, how do we. Um, this? okay. Um, the doctor's safety is first. I won't risk them killing Tarnus. We'll do this the hard way. Then you shouldn't go in alone. I borrowed a stealth field. I don't know, it. honestly. It makes me practically invisible. I and don't know if I have them activated or if they're just slow. By surprise. What do you think? Um. Sounds too dangerous. I don't want you getting hurt. I can handle myself in the fight. The only reason I'm still a Padawan is because of my master. I've passed every test. Master Koix just doesn't think I'm serious enough to be a full Jedi. But I'm working on it. Give me a chance. All right. I suppose there's no rule against Padawans joining combat missions. Great. Now you see me, now you don't. I'll get into position and attack on your signal. Let's rescue as a doctor. She just literally turned invisible. That's a neat trick, man. If I could be invisible, I'm just saying, like, if I could be invisible, I'm not saying I'd rob a bank or anything, but, man, if I could be invisible, let's just say there's a few celebrities <laughs> who might find pictures of them online. No, let me hush. That's, that's wrong. I'm not going to do that. I'm really not. I just... My goodness, if I could be invisible. Oh, you know what? Honestly, if I could be invisible, this is the real deal. If I could be, since on people doing self-promoting, um, what do you mean, like, um, promoting themselves? Like, um, like I do, I do self-promoting, like, on Twitter, on Facebook, and, um, in the, uh, the Gamers United, uh, the Gamers Community, excuse me. Oh, yeah, if you, look, if you want to promote your stream in here, that's fine. That's totally fine. I'm definitely going, matter of fact, this will probably ha cause me to have to reload. Let me click on you so I can go ahead and, and do a follow real quick. Yes, I've got you followed. Kayla, I've already got you followed. I think I have everyone else in here followed. Let me make sure I'm following Melissa. Okay, I am. And I, th I think... Yeah, 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 yeah. You can, yeah, you can totally promote if you want. I'm, I'm, I'm not one of those guys who's like, I want all the follows for myself. Like, there's no reason people can't follow both of us. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm one of those people, like, I know what it's like getting started, because I am getting started. So, I, uh, pfft, if you want to mention your stream, dude, you go right ahead. Um, and I, I believe I have raids allowed as well. I I'm, I'm not sure exactly how it works, but I believe I have them um, on as well. All right, let's find Dr. Tarnas. Oh, dear. That did not sound good. Oh, that's the girl. That's Kira. I forgot. She's invisible. Oh, dear. That sucks. That's why she's a Padawan. So there's Zir and some Raiders. Let's do this. Well, I got him. That was fast. Oh, 
Bye! Of course, I get to talk to him and I don't get to kill him. Screw that. I'm trying to hear that static. Ugh. Wait, did my game just crash? Did my game just crash? No, it didn't. It just... My game just minimized to desktop because somebody sent me a message, I think, in Discord. Ugh! Jedi scum! I'll kill you. Someday. Someday. I sure killed my self-field generator. Oh, well. It was fun while it lasted. Just make another, honey. My teamwork grand. You did well, Padawan. You handled yourself like a true Jedi, Kira. I need a with that. Ballsy! What is up, dude? It's so... Or dude, I, I can never remember if you're male or female. Let's just say it's great to see you in stream. I love having all my friends in here. This is so awesome. Um, no, I'll handle this. Find the Jedi here. I'll ask the questions. Go I'm ahead. trying. I actually have been having a really crappy day, but you guys just, you guys just, you guys make me so happy. You guys give me so much energy. I just feed off of what you guys give me. Um, you'll get nothing. This boss, the boss would kill me for talking. You'll be protected. Tell us where Dr. Karnas is. We'll make sure no one gets to you. You can't even protect your own people. I ain't saying nothing. Thing is, we don't need him to talk. Not when I can just read his mind. What? Stop that! Get out of my head! Get out! The doctor's in the Black Sun headquarters. Salar has him. She's not That's reading his mind, I bet. Cheap thugs will believe anything. I can't read your mind, stupid. <laughs> you tricked me. Alright, Kayla, I'll check it when I get off the game. I'll check my Instagram. Alright, um... Consider all oh, nice work, Kira. Smooth, Kira. Very smooth. Black Sun is a major crime syndicate. Whatever they want with Tarnas, we better save him quick. Me and my security detail will clean this up. Agent Galen will want to hear about this. Okay, so we have to t talk to Galen now instead of go saving Tarnas. Why can't we just go save him? I just want to save him. Oh, where'd all the bad guys go? I guess after we... Wait, where am I going? I... I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. I actually, um, I played it a long, long time ago. Like, a really long time ago. Um, and I didn't get super, super far. And then, um, my husband passed away. So I took time off from gaming. I, I quit almost every single game I ever played. The only one I stayed on was World of Warcraft. So, I'm kind of coming into it fresh. So, like, I have not done... I haven't done these, these, these quests. And if I did, I don't remember them. So, like, everything is new and exciting. And I'm, I'm actually living for it. Because I love Star Wars. I love I loved Star Wars The Old Republic because with the, the classes and... Um, and like uh, uh, the the soundtrack and the visuals and the the lore, you feel like you're in Star Wars. I love it. It just ropes you in. I absolutely love it. All right, where am I going? Okay, I gotta turn here. Yeah, I just started playing it again, like maybe a month or two ago. And I, it's not the only game I play. Like, Saturdays, I play Star Wars The Old Republic. And then Sundays, I play Star Trek Online because I'm a huge Trekkie as well. I'm not one of those people who's like, oh, if you like Star Trek, you can't like Star Wars or vice versa. I like them both. I love them both. I just love science fiction. And it's not just Star Trek and Star Wars. I love Stargate. I love Farscape. I love Firefly. Battlestar Galactica. Like, I'm just a huge science fiction nerd. I love it. Yeah. Yeah. And, and uh, yeah, it's... I, I had went back a, a couple months back, and, well, probably about three or four months ago, I had just went back to WoW and was streaming it on Wednesdays for WoW Wednesdays, but then recently they decided to let Bobby Kotick come back, and he was... Yeah. Yeah. So I'm not, I'm not giving them my time, energy, or money right now until, until they decide one way or the other what they're going to do. All right, so we have to go this way. All this running in this game, Lord Jesus, it takes forever.
This was fun, though. I mean, I'm having fun with you guys. I think what we'll do is, after we finish Coruscant, we'll come back and we'll do these, these, uh, this mission right here, the Flash, the Flashpoint, only because I really tend to take my time on Flashpoints. I'm not subbed. Um, I'm not subbed because I have an ESO sub and a Fallout First sub. And I think that's it. I think I only have two subs right now. But I'm playing so many games that if I subbed all of them, I would I would be pushing my Patreon constantly. Like in the middle of the stream, every five minutes, I would be pushing that Patreon. <laughs> As it is, I only talk about it like, not every stream, but I think like every other stream or something. Thank you. I'm having I'm having a blast. I'm not joking. Like I'm having such a blast playing the game. The community is so nice. I would have thought that as long as it's been around, um, that the the community would be toxic and mean and unapproachable and very elitist. And that has not been the case. Every interaction I've had, every interaction I've had, with with the exception of like, and it's my own neuroses, but like, like. With the exception of like running across someone who is trying to help, <laughs> and really they're just running around tagging on my kills, that that annoys me. But I mean, other than that, like I've had nothing but great positive interactions. It really is like ESO and, and Swartor have like the best communities. They really, really do. And even though I only play. Um, um, Fallout First on a private server. When I before I got Fallout First, when I, when I was just playing on regular public servers, I never had any bad interactions with them. When the game first started, like every once in a while, you run across someone who kept trying to like hit you or shoot you or something just to engage in PvP, and I was like not having it, and they'd get tired and run off. But I mean, like even there, like I'd have to say the only Doctor Tarnas is the least of our worries, General. The stolen data files had uh -oh. not only on the planet prison. But every weapon prototype and research facility in existence. Oh dear. Our most powerful experimental weapons, and Black Sun has access to them. How could this happen? More importantly, why? What does Black Sun stand to gain? They could make a fortune selling secrets to our enemies. We must act quickly to secure these other weapons. Where are they? Three off world research facilities. Minimal defenses to give them a low profile. Off world. Master Kiewicz and I will split up and protect two. And I'll take the third one. You get the fun part. Rescuing Dr. Tarnas and the copied data files from Black Sun. I'll make it look easy. We'll be back in time for dinner. Hero will stay behind, too. With Agent Galen leaving, her computer talents will be needed. She can be impulsive, but give her a chance. You'll make a good team. We already do. She's rough around the edges, but I like her. She struggles with emotional attachments, as many young Jedi do. Be mindful of that. We should go. May the Force be with us all. I'll escort you to your ships, my friends. Before I go, I'm putting all my resources at your disposal. Oh, I get, I get a new gun? In Black Sun territory. Experienced security officers who've been fighting those gangsters for months. Go to these coordinates. Talk to Sergeant Nidaljo. He can help Nidaljo. rescue Dr. Tarnas and get those copied data files. I appreciate all your help. You've been of tremendous assistance. Thank you. It's been a privilege working with you. Don't underestimate the Black Sun gang. Is this the last time I'm going to talk to him? And they're good at it. Bye, Galen. I'll get her plugged into our security network before I leave. Good luck. Um. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're absolutely... Well, okay. Yes, you're absolutely right. I will say this. Um about the LGBTQI thing. Um, in WoW, when I do play it, I play on um, Proper, which is like the gay server, so I don't have any problems with like harassment or anything like that. Um, believe it or not, <laughs> believe it or not, it, it was hard um, finding a good 
fit the last time I played in Star Wars The Old Republic because I couldn't find a guild that was very accepting. And whenever I would just say, hey, are there any guilds recruiting that are LGBTQI friendly, I would get kind of attacked by people. They'd start whispering, we're like, why does that matter? And it's not like I'm trying to like only play with gay people or, or talk dirty or anything. It's just sometimes it's nice to mention your boyfriend or going out on a date or talk about drag race and not be, you know, uh, bombarded with negativity. But that being said, like, that I haven't had any of that this time around. Everyone's been really nice and friendly, and when I ask questions, they're very helpful, that sort of thing. All right, so I have to go this way. Same gay, but, I mean, I don't pass judgment on straight people. <laughs> All right, so there's a quest over here. Let's go find it. Oh, uh, is this the one where you have to talk? This is one thing I think I remember, but there's a quest that you pick up from these robots that talk in riddles. This is it. This is it. I just, I just saw the, yeah. This is the only quest I remember because it was just so, wait, this isn't it. Wait, what is that? What is that thing? Lore object. Okay. Same. I try to make friends with everybody. Oh, that's a PvP mission. Never mind. This isn't it. This isn't it. Maybe it's somewhere else. That makes me sad. I always loved that one quest because it sent you like down into like the underground and you had to fight against critters and whatnot. this way. Why am I friends with Eric? <laughs> I'm trying to figure that one out. Why am I friends with Eric? This is, <laughs> I was just about to say it's not his personality, but I love Eric to death. He's a sweetheart. He comes in here and he aggravates me and picks on me, but he loves me to death. If I called him upset about something, he'd sit there and listen. He has, actually. All right, we have to go talk to Sergeant Nadaljo. Oh my gosh, that reminds me. I don't know why this reminded me of this, but I got a random text once recently, recently. I don't know if I told Eric about this, but I'm sitting there and this was either one or two things. This is either somebody knew me and was pranking me or just a rando, just a weird rando. This dude sends me a message and he's like, do you spank? And I wanted to be like, hello? Like, first of all, I don't know you from Adam. And that's how you open the conversation with, do you spank? So I sent him a message back with just like, what's wrong with you? To which he responded, I'm bad. I'm like, mm-mm. Not having this conversation. Not not we're not going there. We're not we're not doing that. I really feel like playing Fallout 4. I think after I get off the game, off the stream, I might do some Fallout 4. Just settlement building or something. Just something relaxing. I mean big I love settlement building. That is my I mean, don't get me wrong, I love the game. I'll play the game. For, I'll, I'll, I'll rip that whole commonwealth apart. <laughs> but settlement building is the best thing ever. Sometimes I'm in the mood to troll back. Sometimes I have the energy and the mood, but it, it, you know, usually I'm either at work or I'm streaming, so I don't have time. Although recently, I got one of those, um, those little spam things. It was like, hi, I'm such and such, Justin such and such from the uh, National Guard based in your in your town. Um, any questions you have about like um, um, to, uh, like uh, tuition reimbursement or um, traveling fees or this and that, like basically just trying to recruit me, but it was like, it was, it was obviously just a scam. And I'm just like, dude, really? Oh, I forgot, I've got um, pants got new pants and that right there is garbage let's sell all my junk 
Can I get you anything? As well as all of this crap here that I can't use. And that's it. I'm happy you found my stream too. And ditto, you do seem like a really cool person. I love when people come in here and they start watching and they're like, oh, I'm having so much fun. That is the best compliment ever. That is such a compliment. And I'm, I'm glad that I can be entertaining because I have ADHD, so it's really hard for me to like stay on topic for very long. Like I'll, I'll go to tell you a story and Eric, if he's in here, he'll, he'll agree, but I'm really bad about telling a story with like 17 other side stories. Like I can't just tell a story. I wonder if I can, oh, we did it again. Come on. There we go. I'm trying, there we go. I got, I got across. Ha ha ha. I'm trying to sneak through all the bad guys if I can. All this running. Ugh. I, yeah, I'm really, really bad about that. And it's not like on purpose. And, and what's bad is like, I'll, I'll be doing it and someone like Eric or, um, it, just anyone else would be like, um, are you going to finish the first story? And I'm like, oh, oh, my bad. Let me get back on topic. And then I'll start talking. And then I'm like, oh, and by the way, yeah. I'm wondering if I think I'm going to have to go this way. I'm going to have to fight. It's not that I can't. I'm just, I'm trying to get through it quicker by not fighting. If at all possible. And then we'll grab this dish junk power and then we'll just keep going. There we go. Okay. Let's do it. Oh, I do that all the time. I'll stop in mid sentence and be like, uh, what was I talking about? My roommate's always like, anyway, you know, like he's so used to me doing that. It doesn't even bother him anymore. I wonder if I can sneak past. I think I can. With feet these small, I can sneak past. All right, so now we're getting into an area that we have not been to before. I don't think. Maybe? Oh, wait, there's a there's a quest over here. Captain Theragwin? Captain Theragwin, okay. Didn't I talk to him before? Well, look at this. A Jedi. This is something special. Feel like I should have polished my boots. Okay, he's obviously not impressed. Last officer on the job here since the patrol stop. Welcome to Black Sun Territory. Last officer? Are you saying there's no security down here? Are you kidding me? My commander gave up on the sector a long time ago. I shouldn't even be here. Well, then leave. They venture out of their apartments when they have to scrounge for supplies. Now with no security forces, what future do they have? And Black Sun has a new game. Call it Boom. Uh-oh. I sense that there's more, and not all of it is pleasant. Black Sun steals Republic supply crates, takes a supply oh, crate, no. and breaks the crates with explosives. Then they set the trap crates in the street, make bets on how long before some fool tries to open them. Oh, that's awful. Why would anyone do a thing like that? I don't know. You want to be charitable. Assume Black Sun doesn't think straight. Didn't believe it until I saw it with my own eyes. This mousy little woman. Blown to pieces. Oh, that's awful. Myself. The mechanics are simple, but Black Sun's everywhere. Nearly killed me last time. I can handle Black Sun. I want to make things right. That's absolutely thing. dread. Absolutely. That's just what I, need I follow. I follow Black everyone Sun that hops in here, even if I never see them again. I follow them because, like I said, I never know if someone's trying to get into streaming or if they're already in it but having a hard time. And follows help. Follows help. I'm trying to help everyone in here who wants to stream get. Get affiliate. Okay, so we gotta go this way. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm trying to see if there's any anything lootable over there, but I guess not.
You're right, Bullsy, it really is. I'm gonna kill this guy. He's he's Ooh, no no no. He stunned me. I don't like it. I don't like it. I think when I get off the um stream today, I'm gonna be uh watching some uh faulty towers, I think. And honestly, I feel like yeah, you're absolutely right, Bullsy. The curve after that, it is a steep one. And it, it, it feels like it's never going to happen. And then all of a sudden, like, I'll have a really good show, and I'll get, like, three or four um, follows. And then, like, I remember there was one stream where I got ten follows at once, and I was like, I'm going to be famous. And then after that, it was like, not a single follow for a month. So, yeah, it's you just got to stick to it. You just got to work at it and and have fun with it. That's the biggest thing. Like, when you have fun, it translates to your show. That's the thing. Like, you just, you got to really just let loose and have fun. Wait, am I going the right way? I am not going the right way, guys. I just started killing people. Ugh! All right, so I went the wrong way. I'm supposed to stay on the ground. Can I? Yeah. Oh, in midair! That was cool. That was so cool. Stop stunning me, you fool! That's true. And on and see, I suffer from migraines, so like I have a, a hard time sometimes making it to all my shows and there have been times when I've had to cancel a stream like an hour before I'm supposed to stream. Which feels crappy, but is unavoidable. I mean, it really it just is unavoidable. I've I've been suffering from migraines since my 30s, and so there are days when I just I have no choice and I always feel crappy about it and I always make sure to like I'll get on long enough to let people know what's going on but it just feels crappy but yeah staying on staying on a schedule is 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 really like a lot of work and honestly like I would probably do better in terms of getting follows if I streamed one specific game but I stream um, a different game daily like like, I don't stream on Mondays, but Tuesday I stream ESO. Um, Wednesday I stream usually um, either The Outer Worlds or um, Fallout. And, vice, and same thing for Fridays, because Thursday I don't stream. My stream schedule is, um, is a Tuesday, Wednesday, and then Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Saturday and Sunday are like my sci-fi days. Because, I mean, I, I actually play more games than that. Those are just the ones I stream. I'm also um, running around in Lord of the Rings Online, uh, No Man's Sky, uh, Shop Titans, what else? Fallout 76. I alternate between Fallout 76 and, um, and Fallout 4. All right, where, where am I supposed to be? Oh, up there! There's a stairwell. I'm so stupid. I just kept running around looking for where I'm supposed to be. Now we're now we're cooking with fire, people. We got this now. Okay. I'm not worried about that droid. It really is. I've really, as much as I love these games, and we'll continue to play them. I've really been reconsidering what I'm streaming. I thought about maybe um, doing like a stream a week. Like one whole week do Star Wars. One whole week do Star Trek. One whole week do Fallout. One whole week do The Outer Worlds. Or maybe just sticking to one game and just streaming that. That's the thing. Like, 
it's hard. It's hard to make a decision when I love all of these games and the idea of like one of my one of my followers seeing me play this game and being like, hey, I really want to try that and getting them into that. That's that's something that I struggle with the idea. I've only been streaming for about four, four months, I think. So, I mean, like when I say I'm new to this, I'm new to this. I'm new to not just Wars <laughs> the Old Republic, I'm new to streaming. But I'm having fun. I'm making friends and I'm, I'm, I'm getting followers. And even if I don't get a follow, any followers from a stream, I'm getting views and I'm, I'm getting feedback and, and I'm having fun. So I don't consider any stream like a loss. There have been times when internet issues have screwed up my stream. But for the most part, I've just, I'm having so much fun. And, and it doesn't matter, like, if I make affiliate or not. I mean, I would love to be able to make affiliate. Don't get me wrong. I would love that. But ultimately, the amount of just the fun I'm having in the game pays for itself, you know. And a lot of the times... Um, just the memories I'm making with, with guys is, it's a blasty blast. I have so much fun with you guys. Wait, there's like actual officers in here. What in the world? Is this going to be a thing where I'm going to have to talk to this guy and he's like a crooked cop? Or are they just hiding in here? Corporal. Get a Colto pack on that man. The rest of you prep for evac. Agent Galen sent me. What's happened? Ooh, I got to come up off this heating pad. It's starting and to cook me, y'all. I'm cooking. They're securing a perimeter around their base for you. They hit back with military-grade weapons. Killed six of my men. Seven, sir. Joran's gone. Should, should have got the Colto pack on him. For this fight. Not anymore. We can't help you. Oh, congrats, man. You got really lucky, man. Um. No need to panic. We'll figure something out. All due respect, you don't have a clue what you're up against. We've been fighting Black Sun for months. Now with new weapons and armor, they're unstoppable. <laughs> That's true. We do stop the unstoppable Black every day. Half dead. They didn't suffer a single casualty. There's no hope of victory. If you surrender now, your soldiers will have died in vain. Yeah. Is that what you want? What about the man inside that base waiting to be rescued? You'd abandon him? This is a moment of truth, Sergeant. Do you give up and let evil win? Or stand up and fight? I'll go with you. But I won't ask my men to follow. You don't have to. It's yeah. That's right. We can't let those scum beat us. Count me in. Always wanted to fight alongside a Jedi. Oh, please don't let all these people die we'll when take I take them with the me. Base of security network so we can get inside. Once the network's down, we'll attack the back entrance. You take the front. We'll rendezvous in the base. Be strong, all of you. I'll see you on the inside. Let's double time it, men. Move, move. Alrighty then. Okay, so we have to disable terminals. Um... Yeah, it's not about... It's not about making it big or, or making money off of it. Brother not over mom's coffee. Okay. Um, I, I did set up a Patreon only because if people want to contribute, they can. But, like, it's not, like, a contributing factor to this. Um, hitting affiliate would really just be, like, me being able to tell myself I made it. Um, but I've been noticing a lot of... Oh, oh, she knocked over your mom's coffee. Okay. I noticed a lot of people who have been um, affiliate for a long time have given up their affiliate status so they are able to restream everywhere because once you hit affiliate and you, you like take up the affiliate mantle, you're not able to restream anywhere, if I'm not mistaken. 
So, and I've actually addressed that in, in past streams, whether or not I want to do that or not. Even if I get more than, an, oh, I've got loot over here. <laughs> Even if I get to where I can, I don't know if I will take up the affiliate status. Oh, partners can't restream. Okay. All right, so, okay. Oh, they're like right here behind me, basically. It'd be cool if it was a, um, a heroic. All right, let's do this. All right, we're in Lower Gangland. Is it an amusement park? Am I about to be attacked? Mm, maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe not. I love the sound of my lightsabers. I love the sound of my lightsabers. Honestly, that little humming sound they make, that makes my day. Dread, you have a great day. It was great meeting you. It was great talking to you. Hop in anytime. I'll be streaming tomorrow, although it'll be Star Trek, uh, yeah, Star Trek Online, but I'll be glad to, I'll be glad to talk to you tomorrow. Have a great night. I'll help. I don't normally. Oh, wait. There was a bonus quest here? Are you kidding me? So now I have to run around killing everything. Ding. Dang it. Alright, well, I guess we'll eliminate the uh, terminal over here and then run around killing everything. Ding. Dang it. Dude, can you get up there? Thank you. What is that? Oh, aluminum. Aluminium! Alright, let's go kill Black Sun, guys. I have got, believe it or not, you guys, I have got such a headache coming on. If I didn't know any better, I'd swear it was go gonna rain. Where's the, oh, there it is, I see it now. Alright, so now, wait, what is that? How did I pass that? I guess we'll kill this droid. All by his lonesome. Oh no, he's not by his lonesome. I thought he was, but he's not. Emperor's Casino Chip, huh? Okay. Yeah, we did that. Ooh! Can you please just attack? Alright, I gotta kill... Just one more? Just one more. All right, so now let's go talk to Salar, who is through here, apparently. It's a little bit of a trek, actually. Those are bad guys, and those are bad guys. I was trying to see if there was any, like, gold star bad guys, because loot. I mean, I may be a Jedi, but I still like loot. Yeah, 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 it's this way. Can you please? Oh, I'm going to have to fight. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
At least there's no bonus mission in here. Wait, wait, wait. What am I coming across? Oh! Oh, that's right. I can salvage. I, can, I keep forgetting I can salvage robots. And there's something. Oh, hello, Vigo. Yeah, I love, I love fighting these guys. They're harder, but lord, do they do, do they give me some loots. That's on you, dude. And that's on period, sis. Alright, R2, you better start healing me now. That's it. That's all the loot I got. That was a jip. Where's the... Oh, there it is. There's the salvage I was looking for. Alright, let's keep going. Let's keep going. Let's do this. Now we're in story mode. That's the best thing about a uh, soloing story area. Tarnus, we risk everything for you. Stealing those data files, faking your kidnapping. This is how you repay us. What? Compensated with enough weapons and armor to make Black Sun invincible. Tarnus is a turncoat. There's a Jedi carving up my base. This is your fault. We never should have trusted a Sith. Tarnus is a Sith. It wasn't my doing. Oh my gosh. You won't get away with betraying the Republic, Dr. Tarnas. The name is Lord Tarnas. I shed that old skull. Oh my gosh. I have no time for this nonsense. Finish your portal battle. Coruscant's fate is already sealed. And who is this? Surrender, mm. you scum. We got you surrounded. Hmm. This is Sergeant Nadaljo. He's here to arrest you. I suggest you let him. Black Sun doesn't surrender! They just die. Uh, hello? How did I not... How did I not... How did I do that? And no loot. Are you serious? No loot. That's awful. I can't believe it. We just took down Salar. Black Sun won't forget that anytime soon. We lost some good soldiers, but this victory gives their deaths meaning. Your men fought bravely. You should be proud. Thanks for leading this mission. Black Sun will have reinforcements here soon. Any sign of the man you came to rescue? There you are. He intercepted Salar's holocaun with Tarnas. Can't believe he's a Sith. That's not the worst news. The planet prison prototype here at the lab? A fake. Tarnas stole the real planet prison. Great. Trace that holocaun you intercepted. Use it to locate our Sith base of operations. Already on it. Oh, I was right! Out. Sounds like your work is just started. We won't hold you up. Goodbye, Jim. Okay, so I actually did not expect Tarnus to be a bad guy. I thought he I honestly thought he was kidnapped. I really did. I thought he was kidnapped. I was like, I'll save you. That's not what happened. Not at all. So, so now we have to disarm some booby trap crates. Which is through that door there. I'm gonna have to fight my way through.
Gotcha. Wait, is this the right way? It is. Had to make sure. So now we're looking for booby-trapped crates in this direction. Just looking to see what I had in my bag. Oh, I see one. I meant to ask you guys. Are you guys watching Sandman on Netflix? We just started it because we, we finished Stranger Things. Oh my god. Sandman is so good. You guys have got to watch it. It's so good. It's so good. that over there. Nothing? Okay, good. Ooh, loud. He means it, y'all. I hear him doing something in there, but I don't know what he's doing. I love that leap. That is just so fun. Oh, wait, that was all of them? Oh, I see an actual treasure chest. And some salvage. Okay. We're not done yet. I like how when you're fighting, and it seems to be a slightly hairier fight against, like, like rougher foes, they like they bring up that music. That is so cool to me. It got me some goodies. Yes. All right. So now we just need to skip it a deedle out of here. Hopefully, we'll be able to get out of here through this little area. If not, it'll, it'll, it'll be something else. Wait, what is this? It just says storehouse, or warehouse, excuse me. Huh, there's nothing in here. Okay, so we'll have to go back out and take the long way. Hmm. And 
honestly, guys, after we turn this way... Oh, I can't use that. I know some of these speeders you can actually commandeer. I think after we turn these in, we might call it a day because we're getting close. We're about one... F we're, uh, we're just a little over an hour and a half in. This is the only way to go, apparently. Make sure that's right. Yes. And by the time we get there and turn these in and get our quest rewards and pick up our new quests, we'll be um, pretty much at a stopping point. Oh, let's get away from those guys. What is that? Amorphous green crystal that requires archaeology. Okay, well, we're not going to mess with that. I need to go this way. Ding, dang it. These guys don't take no for an answer, do they? Ooh. Hurting my feet because I got them up on this bar. I've had them up here for the I had them up there for pretty much the whole playthrough, so it's starting to hurt my feet. I don't see if I had anything worth, um, oh, crafting materials. Let's take that. Mm, the rest of this is just garbage, basically. All right, let's sell our junk and repair all. What is that? You are I'm not worried about that. Oh, let's get away from that. Where am I? Okay, where am I going? Oh, I'm not far from where I have to turn in this first one. Okay. I'm not against that. Yeah, it's just this little guy over here. Captain Theraquin. Haven't heard an explosion in a good while. Guess that means you defuse those crates. I think I found them all. Let's hope Black Sun doesn't get any more. We'll make sure. No more people will be killed looking for food. Yeah, that's no awful. Senator. But let me give you a little something for taking care of this. Recognition. No reward is necessary, because I'm a hero. It's a generous offer, but I can't accept. Uh-oh. Rare to find someone not out to make a profit. Who is Probably texting me? Business, so I won't keep you. Watch your back out there. It's probably my best friend, Veronica. Oh, it's it's actually um hold on one second. I keep Excedrin at work and one of my uh, uh supervisors is like, Hey, can I get to Excedrin? I left my bottle at home. And she is killing herself working her tail off, fighting for all of us. Like she really is an amazing advocate. All right. Um, so now we just got to wait. Yeah, now we just got to get back to the speeder pad and fly all the way back home before I get locked out and have to spend the night up here with these weirdos. Oh, there's a, there's a gold guy. I can't get up there. I can't get up there. Dang, dang it. That's her saying thank you. Make sure there's no one there. <laughs> All right, we gotta go this way, this way, this way, this way. We're making it slowly but surely. We're making it. Oh, there's somebody over there killing them guys. Bless him. Now I won't have to deal with it. It's not that I I can't fight those guys. I just don't feel like it. I just don't feel like it. But I will take this this aluminum salvage. Hi. What's wrong? Oh, you sounded bad. The way you said that, hey. Wait, where's it at? Did I pass it? Oh, I passed it. Come on. Yeah, this is the right way. Just making sure, just making sure before we turn ourselves around. We 
got this, guys. We got this. Alright. Let's take the little elevator. And we'll be done. We'll, we'll be... We'll be turning in this quest. Oh, excuse me. Oh, that's the heroic mission. We already did that. All right, let's... Yeah, I think we have to go... Yeah, all the way back to the Senate Plaza. She was just saying thank you with a little green heart. I said, anytime. And this is empty now. I ate both, both of those little breakfast bars, so that's that. I gotta empty my garbage can. It's starting to get full. Not overflowing, but full. I never let it get that full. And I think on our next stream, guys, we're going to go pick up that, um, that flashpoint. Those take longer because I tend to, like, uh, draw them out and read everything and make every choice and, and, and find all the lore objects. Yeah, we just going to keep, keep, keep trucking on, keep trucking on, keep, keep, keep. What is a macro... Binocular mission. I don't know what that is. That's weird. We'll check into that later. Yeah, I'm just making sure I'm going the right way. I think they're called the Gree. I just thought of that. The um the the droid missions that you pick up that like they send you, they they talk in riddles, but they send you on some really good missions. I think they're called the Gree. They they're like uh everything is in black bisector and it needs to be in purple parallelogram or something like that. It's just nuts the things that they say. All right, let's talk to General Var Sutra. Listen, working as my chief scientist, how can I defend the Republic if I can't trust my own people? Tarnus's entire Fair engineering team vanished along with the planet prison. They're all traitors, too. The Sith want us to panic. Don't give in to fear. Tarnus will use the planet prison against Carson. He could trap us here forever, paralyze the Republic by holding us hostage. You're our only hope of stopping that. I'll stop him, General. But I need to know where he is. That's where I come in. I just traced that hollow call we intercepted from the Black Sun base. Tarnus was communicating from down in Sector 439. Dustacar territory. Tarnus knows we're not welcome there. Dustacars are paramilitary vigilantes. They took over a sector, cut ties with the rest of Coruscant, and they don't like visitors. Alright, let's find out about them. You call them vigilantes. Explain. Many Justicars are ex-Republic military who came home to find gangsters controlling their neighborhoods. Ah. Oh. They believe the Republic abandoned Coruscant to crime, so they've taken matters into their own hands. Justicars are well trained and armed, but they don't concern me. It's the Sith Lord I'm worried about. Yeah. You shouldn't face Tarnus alone. I may only be a Padawan, but I can help you. <sighs> I'm carrying on. With this much at stake, two Jedi are better than one. True. 
stop Tarnus before he uses the planet prison against us. The fate of the Republic rests on your shoulders, Jedi. May the Force be with you. So I don't get to take T7 with me? Uh. Oh. I want to take T7 with me. Granted, she's still going to be, um, she's going to be my, my, my companion for this mission. And she's set, they, I guess the, the default setting is to, uh, for them to do heals. That's fine. That's fine. I'm not against her doing my heals. I just really wish T7 could come with us. I love T7. He's my little buddy. He's kind of like Hoppy here. Hoppy's my little streaming buddy. T7 is my Jedi buddy. How are things? You okay? And I think this is where we're going to leave it for now, guys, because I think after this, it's going to be like a, a, a final mission in this area, and then we'll probably end up going to our next location. And we're close to the two-hour mark. And by the time I get situated and log out, we'll be pretty much close to the two-hour mark. So our next playthrough, guys, will be, um, we're going to pick up the, the, uh, the flashpoint here. I think it's, it's a hammer station. Let's let's mouse over it real quick and find out. Yeah, hammer station is the next flashpoint, which we'll pick up from J eight R dash one. Okay, so this is where we're gonna leave it because the next time we come in, we're gonna pick that up. So let's leave it with a nice little close up of our character, Corsair with Kira, Kira Carson. And let's go ahead and quit. Yes. And that's one of the things I do like about this game. When you go to log out, it logs you out. Like, you're done. It's it, it, You don't have to wait for a countdown or anything. Some games do that if you've been playing them for a while. But most of the time, it's... Yeah, I just clicked on the wrong damn thing. Ugh, aggravating. That's what I was trying to click on right there. So I could blow this up so I could talk to you guys face to face. Ugh. Anyway, thank you guys so much. I want to say a big... Uh, shout out to Eric, Seagam, uh, Melissa, Michaela, Dread, Bullsy, everyone who was in here today talking, everyone who was in here lurking. You guys drive me to do this and give me all the energy I have to do this because it was a rough day and I almost didn't stream. <laughs> yesterday I almost didn't stream too because my... I don't know, what, well, why didn't I almost stream yesterday? I think it was, oh, because I, um, I took that weird, like, 45-minute nap, and it just screwed my head up. It, I had, oh, I had the hardest time falling asleep last night. Matter of fact, I was laying in bed last night, guys, and it was, like, maybe 8 o'clock, if not later, and I was like, I need to go eat something. I had to go make a peanut butter and jelly sandwich, but as soon as I ate, fell right to sleep. I love peanut butter and jelly. It's like... It's like one of my all-time favorite things to eat. I could eat it probably just about every day. Anyway, um, guys, if you could check out my uh, socials, I have them linked below. I have my YouTube, my Facebook, my Twitter, my Instagram, and my Patreon. Um, I also have the Robots Radio Network um, in one of the panels down below. If you guys are interested in what I am doing and you, you would con like to consider contributing, check out my Patreon. It's extremely low. Like... I'm not going to make money off how I have my Patreon set up. It's not about being rich. I mean, this turning into an all full-time career is the dream, but it's not about being rich by any stretch of the imagination. It's about being able to just, like, buy a case of water and my little powder drink mixes. That's what the Patreon's for. That's why it's almost nothing. It's I, I'm not trying to take people's hard-earned cash. 
Anyway, um, you guys, thank you so much. Oh, also, if you have any questions, concerns, thoughts, comments, or suggestions for other games you'd like to see me play, put them in the suggestion box below. If you don't want to put it there, feel free to DM me. Also, I take friend requests on Insta, Facebook, all of that. Just let me know who you are. If you're coming from my stream, let me know because since I started doing this, I've had some... I've had some unsavory characters just trying to, like, hack me or, or, you know, try to talk dirty to me. It's always a woman trying to talk dirty to me, which does nothing for me. I don't think they pay attention to what I'm saying and doing in here. I don't think they, I think they just see a dude and they're like, oh, we're going to send women uh, in bikinis to, like, be his friend. I'm like, that does nothing for me. Nothing for me. I don't want to see a guy in a bikini either, for that matter. I'm past that. It's all about these games. That's what it's about. It's about saving the world and killing monsters. That's it. That's it. So you guys have a great day. And don't forget, we're streaming tomorrow. Tomorrow is Star Trek Online because we, we skipped it last week. We did a whole week of Fallout 76. So we're back on our schedule. So tomorrow's uh, Star Trek Online. We're going to hop on Jameson. I remember my character's name this time. That's crazy, because usually I don't remember all my characters' names. But we're going to hop on Jameson, and we're going to get on the USS Equinox. I remember my ship's name, and we're going to we're gonna save the galaxy. You guys have a great day. I will catch you tomorrow. Be safe, be kind, and happy hunting. Bye!